All right, this morning we are talking about headaches and they are seriously a gigantic pain, literally in every way possible. Um, there's actually a neuroscience expo that's gonna be going on here locally. And we've got one of the speakers here to talk about headaches and what we can do to alleviate it, Dr. Jeffrey Frank. He's a neurologist specializing in headache medicine at Norton Neuroscience Institute. Thank you for being here. My pleasure. Help us out because this is a big problem for well, a lot of folks. It is a big problem. That In the United States, there's more than 40 million people with my Migraine. Mm. Uh, it's highly underdiagnosed. Um, <clears throat> so most people with migraine don't even know they have it. Really? Yes. They just think what? Something's bothering me and they don't know what it is? Yes, they just they pretty much ignore it or just lay down, uh, take some ibuprofen, Tylenol, Excedrin, uh, and that's it. And that's not helpful? Usually not. Because? <laughs> because it doesn't take care of it. Mm-hmm. Uh, and it can cause problems. If you take it too much, it causes what's called medication overuse and you, it causes more headaches. Okay, so what's, what's the deal? Is it our phones? Is it our stress? Is it our environment? What's going on here? It's hereditary. Okay. Migraine's hereditary, usually an autosomal dominant, but we don't know the exact uh, gene abnormalities, but it's, it's very common. Uh, it's, and as I said, you're, you're usually born with a tendency and you never leave the tendency, the, the tendency's with you your whole life. So what do we need to be doing to try to alleviate some of this pain? Depends on how much disability there is. Mm -hmm. If you're having a lot of disability, then you need to see a headache doctor. And that's it? They'll, they'll go and they'll fix you up? What, I mean, because I know we people try. that have seen doctors over and over again, but they're still suffering. We try. I, yeah. th I have seen patients who have seen many, even neurologists, uh, just because we deal purely with headache. We do a little bit better job. We look more into what the problems are and take care of them. Okay. How important is sleep with all of this? Sleep is very important. Um, that's a, if the, had you asked me, the one thing that's important is, is sleep. With bad sleep, causes worse headaches. So good sleep is less headaches. Compounds the problem. All right, so if people want to attend this uh, Neuroscience Expo, they can do so. That's happening on Saturday the 16th, 8 a.m. to 3 p.m. Dr. Frank is going to be speaking there. It is free, but they do want you to register if you can do Correct. that ahead of time. That would be super helpful. Um, and there's going to be a number of speakers. Who is this best for? Who should be going? Caregivers and family members of sufferers? Anybody sufferers? with neurologic problems, okay. anybody, any of the caregivers, Anybody who wants to know more about neurologic problems, we have different tracks. The headache is one track. We have movement disorder. We've got uh, <clears throat> MS, dementia, and there's even a track on what to expect if you have neurologic disease. Okay. So what's the bottom line? What's the takeaway you want folks to hear this morning? If you're interested in neurologic problems, come to it. All right. There's also vendors that, that take care, that show the drugs that, that we use and the services so people can look around and see what they need. All right, Dr. Frank, thank you for being here. We appreciate it. My pleasure. All right, send it back to you.